myself some iced coffee. I know it's winter. I know iced coffee is not a thing at this season, but we're doing it. Okay. <laughs> iced is literally the only way that I will drink coffee, so all I do is literally just mix milk with espresso. Um, I know we have a really fancy espresso machine in the background, but I don't know how to use it. It's my boyfriend's. <laughs> the udon noodles looked sketchy in the beginning but I think it came together beautifully <laughs> so I just added some sesame seeds sesame 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 seeds and enjoyed that while you guessed it watching Jane the Virgin and then I still had to do a little bit of school work school work school work or uni work whatever you want to call it and then and then and then and then and then it was time for the itch So today was actually like a full body functional day. At the moment, I can only work out about like three times a week. So I do one upper, one lower body, and one full body. So that is what today is. So then I practice my handstand strength and do like shoulder taps. And I also kind of practice like one arm handstands. The right arm is definitely a lot stronger than the left arm. See, I have a lot of like balance issues here, but it's okay. We're working on it. After that, I do scapula push-ups. Is that what these are called? I don't know. That's what I would call them. And then after that, I do need a short break. Um, so I just kind of shake out my wrists, do whatever I need to. Maybe do some like arm, shoulder, circle thingies at like towards the wall. I go back into the handstand and I do these, I'm not really sure what to call them, I draw quarter circles. Is that what we're calling them? Sure, why not? <laughs> so I just try like different variations of handstands um, when trying to practice them just to kind of get my strength back a little bit. And then afterwards we were back to legs and glutes, so here I'm just doing these one-legged RDLs or Standwagen or whatever you really want to call them with a kettlebell. I feel this a lot more with a kettlebell versus doing it with 
watching Suits. We are also re-watching that show. If you have any new show recommendations, please let me know because we are currently just binge watching old shows. And here I just was drinking my freshly made juice. I think it's mint, lemon, orange, and ginger. And I had some more work to do. And then suddenly a friend of mine was like, do you want to come to the Christmas market with us? So unfortunately I completely forgot to film. We did go to another one afterwards and I had a very delicious crepe with yogurt. Highly recommend. Very, very delicious. <laughs> but this is us on our way back and I was honestly so tired after this. So, um, I just went directly into the bathroom to get ready for bed. So I just take this BB wash gel stuff and just, 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 just clean my face with it and remove any makeup rests. Then I take this AHA, AHA peeling, the AHA peeling, which is like a chemical peeling, like it's, it doesn't have like any sugar or salt or anything in it. Um, you just leave it on and then just apply your lotion as you normally would. Um, so you don't really need a serum anymore. So I do this about like twice a week. I've only been using it for like a couple days now, but I think it works pretty well. And then of course, my beloved, 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 um, lash serum, if you will. And I also have this homemade lash serum with castor oil and rosemary oil. through my hair because they um they were very naughty so i first go in with a normal brush to get out all of the dangles 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 and then i go in with this brush it's like wild boar bristles i believe it's called and it just kind of like increases the blood flow in your head and my hair stylist i guess you can call her she is said to do this like every day for like a hundred strokes throughout your hair so that is what i've been doing i can't tell you if it's made a difference but it feels very nice <laughs> and then i just add some like leave-in conditioner spray honestly don't think this does very much but it smells good <laughs> and then just some hair oil some hair oil some hair into my regular like bun i'll either do like a bun or braids but we're doing a bun again today i don't know why i'm giving you a, a tutorial on this but you're welcome and then i just brush my teeth Obviously, this is not what every single day looks like, but I thought I would take you with 